morning to all of you msc physics second year we want to continue our second chapter which is solar radiation and its measurement so last few lectures we have to complete here the first part of this chapter which is solar radiation and in last lecture we have to start the point which is solar radiation measurement and in this measurement we have to see that there is three main types of the instrument which is considered as pyroheliometer pyranometer and sunshine recorder already last lecture we have to seen here the first type which is considered as the pyroheliometer and this pyroheliometer which is used for to measure or to detect the beam radiation or which is called as the direct radiation and this pyroheliometer which is considered as small telescope like instrument whatever solar radiation which is incident on the this pyroheliometer so that recorded with the help of the thermopile junction and we have to analyze that what type of radiation which is incident on there now in this lecture we want to see the next point of this instrument which is considered as this pyranometer and this pyranometer which is consist of the pyranometer which is consist of to measure the solar radiation the types of measure the solar radiation which is considered as total radiation or which is considered as the global radiation or which is considered as this instrument which is used to measure either global or diffuse radiation which is falling on the horizontal surface of the hemispherical field of view so that means that so that global or diffuse radiation which is incident on the earth surface so that whatever radiation which is incident on this instrument for this spherical ball this like spherical ball structure and here the black surface so that whatever radiation which is incident as here so that radiation which is incident for this black surface and this black surface which also heated so now consider that first point that pyranometer is an instrument pyranometer okay so that first main point which is consider as the pyranometer is an instrument pyranometer is an instrument to measure to measure either global or diffuse radiation okay so this pyrometer is an instrument to measure either global or diffuse radiation and this pyrometer figure which is see here so this part which is consider as the platform so this is known as the grounded bolts and this plate which is considering as the mounting plate and this plate which is consider as the guard plate and this surface which is black surface and this dome which is consider as the glass domes which is the spherical like bowl and uh, if we see that basically that pyranometer which is consist of that black surface so this black surface which is heats of when exposed to the solar radiation and what what is the amount of that heated so that its temperature its temperature which is increase until the rate of heat gain by the solar radiation and it is equal to the rate of heat 
which is lost by the convection conduction and the radiation so depends on this phenomena so this pyrometer which is working principle so that is the it is black pit or black surface which is heated up to the until the solar radiation the temperature increase by the rate of the solar radiation that heat gain is equal to the rate of heat which is lost by the different phenomena which is considered as the convection conduction and re radiation and uh, by heating of this uh, black surface so that the here the junction which is called as the thermopile junction and that the hot junction of a thermopile that are attached to the this black surface so that's why we have to see that this dot dot line which is indicate that this thermopile junction which is attached to this black surface and while the cold junction are located at the under the this guard plate and this cold junction so that does not receive that uh, uh, heat radiation or solar radiation and uh, due to that that radiation which is directly as the result which are emf is the generated which are emf is generated and this emf which is usually the range of the range of which is considered as 0 to 10 millivolt which is can be read or recorded or integrated over the period of time and it measure of the global radiation so now second important point which is considered as so this black surface which is heated up what condition which is the temperature increases until the rate of the solar radiation which is equal to the rate of heat lost by the convection or convection or conduction this phenomena so now we want to see here so this pyrometer which is consist of second point which is consider here so this pyrometer it consist of it consist of a black surface which heats up a black surface which is heats up which is heats up when exposed to the solar radiation when exposed to the solar radiation and when it's exposed to the solar radiation at what range so that is its temperature increase until the its temperature increases until the its temperature which is increases until the rate of heat gain rate of heat gain by solar radiation is equal to equal to is equal to the rate of heat loss by rate of heat loss by convection or conduction 
or which is considered as re-radiation okay so this is the important point of this so first of all this parameter which is used for instrument to measure the either global or diffuse radiation and this phenomena working principle which is depends upon that black surface which is heated up which is its that temperature which is increased until the rate of heat uh, which is gained by the solar radiation is equal to the rate of heat which is lost by the convection conduction and re radiation phenomena so that working principle which is considered as this radiation which is incident on this bowl and this concentrated radiation which is incident on this black surface and if this black surface which is heated up so what happens here that under the guard plate so that here uh, cold junction is there uh, so that which is not allowed the solar radiation and due to that this hot junction and this cold junction that emf which is generate or produce and due to this hot radiation or hot junction that thermopile is there and generated how that emf so that is the record the solar radiation uh, generally this type of the pyranometer which is also used in the india or the global level to measure the global either total solar radiation or which is considered as the diffuse solar radiation and this is done by the mounting it is at the center of the mounting the plate which is at the center of the semicircular shading ring or this is considered as the semicircular shading ring and the shading ring which is fixed that such a way that its plate is parallel to the plane of the path its plane which is parallel to the path and whatever solar radiation which is incident on this so that have record and we have to analyze that what is the range of the solar radiation or we have to analyze that that have the short length uh, radiation or uh, long range radiation and which type of the solar radiation so we have to analyze this idea now in next lecture we want to see here the next type of instrument which is called as the uh, sunshine recorder and this sunshine recorder which is used in the a uh, brightly sunshine ray brightly sunshine which have having a day so that uh, that number of hours so what number of hours so that bright sunshine rays have there in a during the day or time so in that time so that how we have to that record card is there uh, below the spherical ball and that recorded on this card that tip of the surface so that we have to analyze that so what type of radiation which is incident on this bowl and what type of radiation which is recorded in this tip of card so that concept will be seen in the next lecture so thanking of